What's up everybody? Welcome to Moju Monday. I'm sorry about the delay. This week was crazy. Someone from our team got sick. We had to go to the hospital. We were on the bus, on a boat, off the boat, back on the bus. It was a crazy week. This is an intro to the intro, which is overkill, I know, but there's a few questions I wanted to clear up. There are people, including my own family, who really have no clue what I do on a daily basis. So to help you understand what my day looks like, I shot this video in one day. So this week, this is a day in the life. What's up, guys? Mo, it is way too early for that. Look how big is an organic cucumber. It's literally as big or as small as my finger. Dude, in the state, it's literally enough. You buy it like this. Split it between you and your neighbor. <laughs> Come on, dude, that's the last bag. Dude, we have an overnight, that means to Yeah, let's eat, the let's eat them tonight. Let's eat them tonight. Let's eat them tonight. Don't you no, give me the cheese noodles. No. <laughs> what, what do you have on your head? Dude, so, I gotta tell you how I got this. During the show, I took it from somebody. I was like, you know what? I want it. Wait, look, look down. It says happy birthday. <laughs> Your eyebrows are falling into your beard. They always do that. It must be Thursday. <laughs> Go to bed. <laughs> Zonsburg. Do you guys know the the code for the country? I literally just woke up off the bus. They're asking me country questions. Back in the hotel. Uh, well, I should probably get things that I need. I am ready for the city. Nice right? right? Thanks, man. Uh, my mom. Can I ask you some questions? Uh, I'm not, uh, super sweet. Thank you. <laughs> Usually, you do a good presence come with words of advice. What was the words of advice you <laughs> came along with it? Wear it in good health. <laughs> <laughs> so here's what happened. 
<clears throat> before I left for tour, I told my mom I used to have a fanny pack and it used to be so convenient. And my mom, dead serious, out of the kindness of her heart goes, oh my God, I have a fanny pack. It's a really nice one, you can have it. And she gave me this, her sport line. <laughs> you were know, such a good son. You're you know such what? a good son, man. I got a rocket one time, so mom, it's hi, coming to Norway. Hi, mom. <laughs> That's for you. Dude, this is actually perfect. It fits all of my things that I need. Perfect, it holds everything. Thanks, mom. <laughs> All right, here's my task. So this is my life bag, this is my backpack I've had with me every single day for the past three years of my life. I have to fit all of the things that are in here into this fanny pack. Okay, that's probably not gonna fit. But that's not that bad, I can get that stuff in there. I put it on and, pink. and I immediately feel better than everyone else. It's amazing. You see, there's a net there too. There's a. See that net. Yep. So yeah. voice recorder's going in exactly. here. So you can. See. Nope, voice recorder doesn't fit in there. Mm, Perfect. Nice. Convenient. I love convenience. What about this one? Oh, there you go. Nope. Nope. <laughs> so it's going to go right there. How's that? No, that doesn't quite work either. Wait. Almost forgot the tripod. Zipper pocket. Nope, that's not going to fit either. Okay. Well. So what did you accomplish from. Okay, so what we did here is we moved some things that were on my back that I kind of had to like get to and be annoying. And now, I don't even have to look down to get my deodorant. I can put it out right now if I want to. I'm still looking at you. What do you need? Well, I'm about to eat this camera. Can we go eat something, please? Uh, wait. Without a wallet. Glad you thought of that now. And how do I get back to the room without a key? It's on the desk. Those. I did. That's why I have a wallet and a room key. That's why you have a fanny pack. Uh, that's why I have my fanny pack on. You're absolutely right. <laughs> See, I don't have no fanta bag. So, dude, you know Moju is a future brand, not just fanny pack, just a brand. Yeah. Oh man, they got a bake sale. Are you kidding me? Ah. All right. Where will the fanny pack go? Well, where are we going? I really want to see those ship being built. But maybe I, I get it. You're hungry. Let's go get food first. Oh, Mo, you need one of these rugs. Dude, you don't think I have one? <laughs> I have two. Are these off? Feels like my uncle. This is beautiful. Dude, where was this when we were funky shopping last week? Dude, this is so risky. I put my phone on a little metal like hook like to tie your boat to, but it's like kind of up in the air. Why? Because it's the only way I could get the shot. Please don't fall. Please don't fall. We just had an amazing lunch. It's time to pay for lunch. And guess who's got the convenience of the fanny pack? Well, you have to hold the camera. You can't fanny pack and vlog at the same time. So we just got this sweet new fanny pack. My mother gave it to me. It's nice, isn't it? Just conveniently put this back in my fanny pack. You love that fanny pack, don't you? Dude, go get your phone. I already had a heart attack. Right? Now you see what I'm talking about. Look at where my camera was. <laughs> Man, this was like one little gust of wind away. Very carefully. Mm. If that was out of focus the whole time, <laughs> I'm gonna be pissed. So this week, we wanted to end things a little differently. My mom told me she wanted to see some better content. <laughs> so we decided to end this vlog with a fireside chat. And I think the topic of our fireside chat should be working smart, not hard. You have to work smarter, not harder. Define yourself with the spare time you have, not the job you do. If anybody works smart, not hard, it is us. <laughs> I was judged all my life for being lazy. Everyone's just like, yo, you're lazy, you should be doing more. I'm like, no, I'm doing enough so I can buy my spare time and do what I want to do. We travel countries, we meet people from all over the world. We just get in, in, in big bubbles and we learn so much from it. Dude, you know we've never actually explained what a bubble is? We keep saying we get in bubbles. We've never explained a bubble. You know what? It's a good time. 
since there's fire right there. Bubble theory is the idea that during our day, we get in a series of bubbles. Being aware of these bubbles is one of the most important qualities because then you have the conscious decision whether you can stay in this bubble or move on to a new bubble. Or you can stay in this bubble and lock it up with steel like Mo likes to do all the time. The reason that Mo and Shiv are such good friends is because Mo is the king of making bubbles. And Shiv is in my and bubble. Shiv is the archer of the century. <laughs> Overall, he's in one big Mo bubble. You guys are both having the time of your lives. You're creating bubbles, and he's popping Just them popping as, as fast as you can make them. Are you wearing a pinky ring? Yeah. I mean, you don't have to call it a pinky ring. That sounds like shit. What would you like to call it? It's ring on my small finger. So you don't have to call it pinky. It's not pinky, and it's not pink. It's the same color as all my fingers. Pinky. What is that, greeny pink? <laughs> Mo, you wanna clean up your seat? <laughs> From this amazing fireside chat.